Hey everybody, it's Angela Perry here again. Sorry my Wi-Fi keeps cutting out when I start a new one, so I'll start over again. So I just want to tell you a little bit about why I'm continuing yesterday's conversation about uh, physical self-care with supplements. And today I'm going to talk a little bit more about medications. And why I'm going to do that is because I have had a lifetime of taking medications, and still am. Um, to start back when I started needing to take medications was I was 13 and I fell down a ski hill and really, really, really messed up my knees. And then I played sports for a very long time, so pretty high impact sports. So I have a lot of um, inflammation and joint pain. Um, and then as I got a little bit older, um, about seven years ago or so, I was hospitalized for a, okay, get ready for this one, a severe acute gastritis attack that caused inflammation and neuronal loss within my enteric nervous system. And so what that means is I now have gastroparesis. Um, it is controlled right now and not progressing, which is just great. Um, and I also have severe migraines, severe anxiety, severe depression, um, severe anxiety. These are all things that I was diagnosed with back then, seven years ago. Um, <clears throat> so at one point, I was on 12 medications, 12 medications. And they were all prescribed and they were all the way from things, an, opi an opioid patch. Um, it, I would give myself injections um, with a into a pick line that was in my arm, um, medication like in uh, <clears throat> medication style liquid form opioid pill form opioid, um, a serious vitamin D two prescribed pill, and everything in between for things like stomach discomfort, nausea, um, nerve pain meds, migraines, and. The nausea med meds that I was on was a dose so large, it was the same ones that they give to chemo patients. And that's what I was on. It's serious, it was crazy. Um, I was on, yeah, anxiety meds, depression meds, and a lot more, a lot more. And I have a little thing right here that I'm gonna show you. Um, this is all that I'm on right now. It looks like a lot. It isn't, trust me. I used to need a huge freezer bag to put all my medications in. Um, I was on 12, I'm now only on six, which is fantastic. I feel great because, you know, I finally this year had enough of it, of feeling foggy, exhausted, and I'm, I'm no longer on any opioids since March 28th of this year. Uh, I'm no longer on nausea pills, depression pills, my migraine pills, one of my anxiety pills, and a couple of other things. Because um, one of the pills that I took actually really, really affected my thyroid and caused me to gain a lot of weight and get extremely puffy. So at the end, I'm going to talk a little bit about what I just found out today that I can do to help me out with that. Yay! And also, in case you haven't noticed, I'm missing a tooth. I had to get that pulled. Um, the acid that's caused in my stomach because of my attack a while ago um, is actually causing my jawbone to get diseased. So I've actually had this whole jawbone replaced. Um, they actually use mashed pig bone. Yuck. But you know what? Feels better. But I need to start getting these ones as well. Oh, hi, Denise. Oh, nice. B12 and magnesium. I'm going to talk a little bit about magnesium for you, um, which will, which I'll get into right away. Um, so what I have done to help me out here, I'm going to talk a little bit about supplements first. So for my stomach discomfort, um, I have been using a thing called ICP and I, hi Denise, and I use this instead of an at home enema. I use my comfort tone to keep me regular. And these are all natural, all, all natural essential oil based 
free of toxins uh, supplements and a para free. So if I feel like I've eaten something bad or um, have a bit of a, a tummy ache from say a flu or something like that, I will take that. Um, when I was coming off my opioid medications, um, and this is just from my personal experience, I used detoximab and I found that this helped me come off of these so much. This combined with a whole bunch of other things. Um, and once again, these are all um, <clears throat> essential oil based, all natural supplements. It's great. And <clears throat> because I had my accident back in when I was 13 and fell down a ski hill, then my knees and my shoulders from playing sports, I have so much inflammation and joint pain. Um, I take three different supplements for that. I take a Selfrazyme, which is literally only MSN or MSM, sorry, and Wolfberry, um, and Agile Ease, which helps my knees and um, all my joints because it has uh, frankincense in it, which is wonderful. And my other favorite one is Omega Gis 3 fatty fish oil. Um, and this just helps me feel like my joints are lubricated and everything. Um, so here we go. I have this thing called Mega Cal. Um, because a lot of people, you, when you take calcium, you also need magnesium to absorb it and vice versa. And so this Mega Cal is literally powder and all it is is magnesium, calcium, um, vitamin C, and there's a lemon peel oil in there to give it a fantastic flavor. And that's it. And it's so good. And it's so good for you. Um, and I get allergies very, very bad. And so sometimes, you know, you just, you can't breathe. Your nose is running, your eyes are watering, and you want to go to that drugstore and buy those allergy pills. But I have found Allerzyme. And these are so great. And for me, it works exactly the same. There is tarragon, ginger, juniper, fennel, lemongrass, and these. And um, there's one more in there, I see it. And peppermint. And it's amazing how fast this works for me. I just love it. And kidney and bladder. I, because I was on all these medications, I have a kidney deficiency and I have a very, very, very small bladder. And so I take these wonderful things called K and B drops. And that's all it is. It's for kidney and bladder. I take three half droppers a day. Um, and this has juniper, parsley, dandelion, German chamomile, geranium, fennel, clove, Roman chamomile, sage, and other juniper branch oils. And it is so much better. So basically these all natural plant-based supplements have replaced a few of my um, prescription based pills. And I was able to do this for me. I mean, everybody has to do it on their own for their own reasons and everything works different for everybody. And it's taken me a long time to get through all of these and figure out which works and which doesn't because everybody's definitely different. Um, so, but when I first started, um, I started with oils and because I did that, um, I used those first to help maintain my pain, my just pro everything that was wrong with me. So like for my self-esteem and for my depression, so I used forgiveness and acceptance, which are pretty much the end all be all names of what self-esteem needs. You need to forgive yourself and accept yourself for who you are. And these ones really, really helped myself a lot. Um, for my stomach discomfort, I used Digize. And Digize is so great. And it's actually NHP approved with Health Canada here. And so um, this can actually help your stomach discomfort as well. And it's amazing. And you can feel it work within three minutes. I love it. Um, for my nausea, I now use ginger. 
This works fantastic for me when I put it on my wrists and behind my ears because um, I'm no longer on those gross and nausea things you stick on your tongue. It was horrible. My migraines. And um, I use peppermint. Peppermint, you can feel it in 30 seconds. Cools off your head. And for me, my headaches just go away. And one of my big issues I've had was panic and anxiety. I've had that for probably most of my life. We were very shy, didn't like to go out in public. I didn't like to do things like this, but now I love doing things like this. And I have these couple roll-ons, and one's called uh, Tranquil, and one's called Rutabella. And the Rutabella has a valerian root, which um, a lot of people have heard of, um, that they chew to help sleep. And Tranquil has a lavender and chamomile and cedar wood in it. And these combined, or even just on them own, for me, depending on my panic or if it's anxiety, it calms me, it makes me stop and think, it makes me be in the moment, it makes me remember who I am, and I just, I love it. And one other thing that, because of the acid in my stomach and chest and throat, and that goes into my mouth, um, one of my favorite things I love to use is Thieves. Thieves essential oil. And Thieves here, has, I'm going to open it up because I forget what's all in it. Here we go. It has clove, lemon, cinnamon, eucalyptus, and rosemary. And when I just put a few drops around here, it just feels better for me, you know? And one of the things I just learned today about thyroid and for, um, it's their personal experiences, of course, so I can't wait to try it. It's something called Endoflex. I just got this today, so I'm so excited. And I guess if you put it on uh, your um, adrenal glands, um, it, it may help your thyroid. So this is one thing I'm extremely excited to talk about. Um, and tomorrow I'm actually going to continue this a little bit more and really only talk about one essential oil, and it's called Neroli. And what happened was Neroli was purchased for my stomach discomfort and ended up helping me do pretty much everything else. So I wanted to do a quick live tomorrow about Neroli essential oil. And so just to end really quick here, I wanted to say um, I, this was all done here with help from a professional. And I personally decided to use essential oils and all natural supplements to help me get through withdrawals of pain, stomach discomfort, and my headaches. Um, this once again is a mindset and this is what worked for me. Um, and please know I'm not a healthcare professional. I am sharing my personal stories as well as sharing, um, as well as using shared and gathered information from others. And you know, always consult a professional when dealing with any type of medications, please. Um, and to finally finish it off, because I did talk a lot about essential oils, I do have these really neat cards here that talk about um, the different oils that are best for your different um, body systems. I have just plain cards like this. I have ones that can go on, on your fridge. It's a magnet, which is really cool. I have one that talks about um, emotional oils for your body, mind, and spirit just like this. And I also have one that's for essential oils from head to toe. And that's what those look like. And if you're interested in getting any of those, um, please message me um, with your address and uh, what country you live in. So I know, well, I guess I will know that with your address. So I know exactly which, um, which flyers to send you because um, they're different for each country, but we are worldwide, which is great. So Anyways, thank you very much for, for joining me, especially Denise. Thank you. That was wonderful to see you here. And we'll see you tomorrow, and we'll be talking all about Neroli. And have a great night. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.